another day in Asnel. So as usual, uh, start off the day at Akiba X. Here's some of their prize figures. Lots of prize figures. It's Nito. Oh god. That was expensive. <laughs> Alright. What else do they have? Emilia. Nito Chris. <laughs> they have Sakura Yai. Yes. Definitely gonna get her. And it doesn't look like they have anything else new. Here's some Figmas. Look at that, Nadeshko and Rin. Still the same price, there's Nidhog. She's cheaper, twelve nine eighty. Hmm. Cinderella girls. That one's pretty cute. There's my senpai. Kanta collection, Dr. Romani. Whoa! That was Jeanne from Fate. Hmm. No game, no life. Rezero. Galvin Slayer, Nidhogg again. I don't know, never mind, that's Neptune. <laughs> Ground Blue Fantasy. Richard Bahamut. Tanya from. Uh, yeah. Alright, next place. Alright, now we're at the Sudagaya Specialty Shop next to the Radio Kai Gun. There's that dude from Yuri on Ice. Super cheap, 20, what, 700 yen for a scale, it's really cheap. Here's all these like cheap DS games, they're all like 200 yen a piece. Hmm, look at this Morrigan, Noodle Topper. Let's see what else they have. I have like a bunch of the older stuff out here. Alright, gonna go inside and see what else they have. Some prize figures, here's their uh, Miku and other Vocaloid stuff. Here's their Fate section. Every store here has like a massive fate section. Mm, not much of anything else that I see though. Let's see, what's that? Noir. There's another Fots one here. You see what a fit, but it is. Oh, nothing I want. Common Rider. Alright. There's their school idol stuff. Hmm. Let's see. Whoa, what's that? Oh my god! It's Yuki! Yep, definitely an instant pickup. Gonna get her. Hmm. Yamashiro. Still need to get my hands on Yamashiro. Alright. Whoa! Whoa! 
All right. I'm at uh, Ami Ami in the Radio Kaikan, and they have a uh, Lycorn Jalter on display. This is insane. She, she's huge. Holy crap. It takes up like this whole box. This is definitely not going to fit in the day top. All right. Let's keep going. Let's see what else they have. It's that one. Look, it's Karishima. Kylo Ren. Kago and Nakagi with long necks. Doesn't look like they have too much of like their new displays. They have this though from Girls Frontline. Let's see what they have here. They have Sakura Yai here too. And not much of anything else that I like. Emilia, they still have Emilia. It's still ch super cheap here, it's like 15,000 yen. Hmm, what else? Riel, Jibril, Dr. Romani. Dr. Romani. Eh. Nothing. I don't think they have anything else cool. Look at that. Look at all this merch. So much merch. More merch. Alright. Let's see. Assassin. From Fate. Here's the smaller Fate section. There's the Huke Saber. Megamine. Dark Angel Olivia. That's pretty cool actually. Hermaphroditus. Some Chinese figures. Snidhog at the bottom. Keys in the eye. All right. All right. Next place we're going to is the Rashing Bang. Rashing Bang. Uh, it's just down the street from the Radio Kaikan. And generally they have like really cool stuff here. Um, last time I went last week, the week prior to last week, they had a section for upcoming Wonderfest stuff. So hopefully they do have like uh, some cool stuff from Wonderfest. Hopefully. Here's a bunch of garage kits. Whoa. Look, they're Smash. It's pretty cool. There's their Square Enix stuff, mostly Final Fantasy. Sailor Moon. All right, let's go ahead and see what they have. Big price down. What? Everything's still super inflated. They lied. All right, whatever. What do they have up there? Luis! I still need her! Waited too long. Now all the prices are too high. It's fine. I'll find her somewhere. Sometime. Maybe. Hopefully. 
All right, over here in this aisle, they have mostly like boat girls, airplane girls, <laughs> girls, oh my god, and Evangelion stuff. There's some Kansai collection and Missouri Lane stuff. I think I already have everything I want from them. And here's their Eva stuff. Ooh, getting close. Look, it's Asuka and Rei. Wow, Christmas. And then some prize figures. There's the Cheryl. That's super cheap, but it is dirty. It's a dirty figure, that's why I haven't bought it yet. Hmm. 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 All right. Nothing cool there. Hey, look. It's their Wonderfest section. Most of this stuff is going to be released next month. And... Wait. Holy crap! It's uh, Kama, the Garage Kid from Wonderfest. 44,000 yen. That's like $400. She was only 15,000. What happened? Scalpers. Scalpers are what happened. They don't have the uh, special limited edition Mysterious Heroine X Ultra, though, by uh, Funny Nights. I missed out on that one in Garage or in uh, Wonderfest, and I am really upset. It was pre painted. It's awesome. It was everything that I needed. But I didn't get it in time, then they sold out. Hmm, what do they have here? Some cool stuff. There's a Spinaria. And that guy passed by kind of really stinks. And there's a Nidhogg. She is awesome. Alright. Let's see. Some stuff. Some more stuff. There's the uh, Mage thing. Which is pretty cool. Don't really see anything. <sighs> Never mind. Look, it's another fairy tale Little Red Riding Hood. She's uh, pretty rare, but it does have writing under the sticker that's <clears throat> generally indicative of there being a discrepancy. Generally, it's like the box is damaged or something like that, or the blister is damaged. Hopefully, that's all it is. <clears throat> and if that is the case, I'll buy it. Oh, look, with Talia. I wish they had one of just Philo. Like, whoa, it's Chino. Definitely getting her. Yeah, if they had one of just uh, Philo, then I'd probably get her. But that one is like a 12 scale rough Talia Philo combo. Not at all. Too about it. Right, here's their fate section. Maybe they have Mysterious Heroin X Alter. Hopefully. And they don't. Sad face. Very sad. Alright. Here we are now at the Mandarake Complex 8th floor. They have some pretty cool stuff. More retro stuff. S some garage kits over there. Look at that. <laughs> it's a clock. <laughs> it's their fate section. Hopefully they have what I'm looking for and so far they don't. No mysterious Aaron X. I'm never gonna get her. It's so sad. Except for like next month. I think she's releasing next month. Well look at that. Final Fantasy stuff. It's a huge box. Madoka. Hmm, Hestia. Hestia Spestia. Cheryl. There's also some writing under that. It's also dirty and scuffed up. What? Why does everyone get this one dirty? Natsu. 26. 
But guys, they marked down uh, the Mithra, I mean not Mithra, Pyra prices. It's because she's getting re-released. Still limited, but she is getting a re-release. Means the prices can uh, plummet. So yeah, get your pre-orders in if you missed out on Pyra and Mithra from the first. Well, look, it's Tielos from uh, Xenoblade or Xeno Saga. She's uh, quarter scale. She's really cool. She has a garage kit though. I have one. I still haven't like assembled her. Uh, still <laughs> suck at airbrushing. So uh, yeah, Spider Gwen. I have Spider Gwen. It's that in the back. Oh, nothing cool. The box is shiny, so I was like, wow. Supergirl. Hmm. Let's see. Batwoman. They had Sengoku from um, the Monogatari series. Hmm. I think that's about it here. All right, guys, we are back at my place. Let's go ahead and see what we got. So I got this uh, Final Fantasy special box by Coca-Cola, actually. Um, <clears throat> I got it for my girlfriend since she's a huge fan of Final Fantasy. At the Mandarake Complex for 5,000 yen. Found out that it's worth like 200 or 250 US dollars. It's crazy. Here is Yai Sakura from Honkai Impact 3rd. She looks stunning in the box. Here is Shino Asada or Sainen from Sword Art Online. And last but not least, we have Yuki from Sword Art Online. Uh, Mother's Rosario, it was the second half of the second season, pretty cool figure. Anyways, if you guys want to support this channel and help us grow, I'd appreciate if you guys shared this with friends, family, and social media. Um, and yeah, leave a comment down below, I do love reading your guys' comments and inputs on these videos and this channel. Anyways. If you liked this video, leave a like, a subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.